Dollars, I like diamonds, I like stunning, I like shining I like million dollar deals, where's my pen? Bitch, I'm signing I like those Balenciagas, the ones that look like socks I like going to the Tula, I put rocks all in my watch I like sexes from my exes when they want a second chance I like proving niggas wrong, I do what they say I can't They call me Cardi, Cardi, banging body, spicy mommy, hot tamale What's good, YouTube? It is your girl, Sherry, aka Glam Fire Beauty here, and I am just doing an update video because I didn't want to just come on here. I didn't want to just come on here and then you guys, um, be like, um, okay, you back now? So, to answer a couple guys' questions, yes, I am back officially. I don't know, but I will be doing more makeup tutorials. I know, I know, y'all heard me say the whole couple of times before that I was back and I was back to doing makeup and whatever. But um, really, I just been trying to focus on me, focus on my family, get right mentally because makeup in a while y'all and I'm kind of nervous I mean I know and y'all see my makeup tutorials they was like oh she could do makeup you know but I haven't done it in a while so it's almost like taking baby steps so this video is not about that but it is about makeup okay um so I'm going to show you most not all of the stuff that I've got throughout the year while I was off taking a break from YouTube so Without further ado, let's get into this haul video. Okay, and we're back. I have a whole bunch of stuff from probably December until now from when I was buying stuff just because I wanted to buy stuff, just because I wanted to feel good. Um, I probably, I don't know, I might use it, might not use it. I just wanted, just, wanted it just to have it and so yeah. So I got some things from Sephora, Juvia's Place, I got some wigs, I got uh, some foundations I do need to review. So I'm going to show you briefly some of the stuff that I brought. And hopefully you guys will be seeing them in future videos. So the first thing I got was one of these Sephora play boxes. Half the stuff is gone already because as I said before, I already used them. So, they are probably a trash or something, but it pretty much just came with a whole bunch of sample stuff. And the first sample is uh, a brow wig from Anastasia. The second thing is a Lancome foundation. I don't know what shade it's in. Well, it's in different shades, as you can see. And that's just, I can't even call that a sample. I don't know what to call that, honey but <laughs> whatever and then the last thing I haven't used in the bag yet was this rose face mask it looks like this so yeah all the other stuff I already used it was face lotion it was um, a hydrating face thing it was chapstick and something else but those were good so and this was I think I don't know if I got this for free or I paid ten dollars for it I can't remember but I digress. So, the next thing is the other stuff I brought from Sephora. And I think I got this for Christmas. So, the first thing is this Becca 12 Hour Shine Control Well, Ever Matte Perfecting Primer. I got it in the small box because I didn't know if I would like it or not. So, so this is, I got a trial size. This is the Ever Matte Pore Perfecting Primer. Um, and if y'all want to see anything like up close, you want a more in-depth review, just let me know since I am somewhat back. I'm guessing that's the way I will be getting these videos on and ship hopping. So just let me know. The next thing is the Sephora Pro Palette. It looks like this on the outside and as y'all see it has fingerprints because I did swatch them. But I didn't do no makeup look. And I'm thinking about doing one tomorrow. So, I might just see that. And as y'all know how Sephora packaging is, the, here are the shades. And I think I got this to kind of inspire me to get back into doing makeup, especially like um, colorful, bold looks, because I know I have some colors 
in my looks, but they're not like bam. So, <laughs> yes. But if y'all want to see swatches, you want to see a makeup look, you want to see any kind of colors that's in that palette, uh, in depth review, my good, the bad, the ugly, um, let me know down below or give me a like and like things so I know that you guys are liking the video. And then the next thing I got, see, it's covered in dust. The next thing I got was the Violet Evolve Pro Hashtag Palette. So, and I really like this. I like, I don't know why I got the palette, but I like it. Maybe because it has purples in it. And purple is one of my favorite colors. So, I will show you guys this one because I don't, I haven't seen it on YouTube. So, I'm guessing by me doing a, a video on it, it won't hurt at all. So, this is what it looks like. I took the plastic thing off because I hate it. But this is what the shades look like. And it has a big mirror. Don't want to blind you guys, but it has a nice mirror. This look. Nice mirror. But that's what the shades look like. And I'm really liking this color, this color, and this color. I like them all. Okay. I like them all. It's a nice, warm, beautiful toned palette for moi. And I can't remember the price I paid for it, but if I do, I will have it listed down below. And everything that I have, you want to know, I will have the um, links to them down in the description box. I hope, I hope, it should be down in the description box. And then I brought this Tarte Eyeshadow um, Brush Set. I know this was like $10. This is a little $10. But I basically got it for this brush, this brush, and this brush. And maybe this brush, I don't know. But I have enough of these, so. But I don't have a lot of lemon brushes. And this is the Tarte Toast the Good Life Eye Brush Set. I'm guessing it's supposed to go with the um, Tarte whatever palette. Heat palette, naked heat palette, I don't know. Toasted palette, is that what it's called? Whatever. But I'm guessing that's what it's supposed to go to because it has the same little fire, heated, direct, whatever title to it. So, yeah, anyway. And the next product is something I've been waiting to have, like, all since starting to do my makeup. And I was just that girl, no, nah, I don't want to buy a high end product. It's too expensive. What if it don't work? Then what if it do work? Then it's the only foundation I have to buy in my life. So I was like, you know what, just get it. Your husband is surprising you. He's spoiling you for the, f he's spoiling me. Okay. So I've got the Kat Von D Lock It Foundation. And this is in the shade Deep 71 Warm. And I hope that it matches me good because I have heard that, well, I don't like, personally, I don't like ordering off a line because you can never really tell just by the picture if the um, shade is your found, is your shade, and I'm the kind of girl who don't like man with stuff bad because I ain't got time. I should have just, I don't know. But I'm hoping and I'm feeling that, I don't know. I don't know. Y'all, I don't know. But yeah. And the last but not least from Sephora, I got the Anastasia, Anastasia Sugar Glow Palette. And this is what it looks like in the back. I swatched the hell out of this pack, this um this uh palette, y'all, because this is my second glow kit. I think this is my second. This is my second glow kit because the first one I had was the Nicole Guerrero one, and I either lost it or gave it to a friend. But yeah, this is what those look like up close in person now. If y'all want to see swatches, let me know down below. Okay, here we go. This is how we're going to do this, y'all. If y'all want to see a video on a certain thing, do hashtag whatever that thing is. So if it's this glow kit, hashtag glow kit. If y'all want to see the Violet Boss palette, just hashtag Violet Boss. You know what I'm saying? That way, hopefully I won't be wasting my time doing a whole bunch of uh reviews on palettes that everybody's already seen and I can just jump right into doing makeup looks. So, let me guys know. Let me guys know. What the fuck is that? Let your girl know, okay? 
All right, that's the end for Sephora. That is the end. All right, so next on my list is the stuff that I got from Juvia's Place. It is not that much. Only got three palettes. Um, and I felt like these three were the most wanted palettes, in my opinion. So that is what I wanted to get. And also because it seemed to fit me the most. And one of them I just had to get. Like, you can't just go to Juvia's Place and not get this palette. So I, I, I went and got this palette. But the first thing is, I don't know which one I can do first, okay? You know, okay, here we go. All right, now remember, if y'all want to see videos on these palettes, hashtag, half, I can't talk. I'm so excited, I can't talk. Hashtag the name of the palette, okay? Or who the palette is by. Hashtag the festival palette by Juvia's Place. Look at this, y'all. Look at it! But yeah, this is the palette. The, I don't know if this one was the one I wanted the most. I don't think it was, but it's new. And Juke, this place is kind of new to me because I already have, I think that's the Nubian palette. I already have the Nubian palette. So, I thought I'd, I'd throw in some color because spring's around, it's right here. Summer is right around, no, it's nowhere. Spring is nowhere. But, um, yeah, I got the Juke's Place palette. This is what it looks like up close and personal in your face. Bam! And... I love the colors in here. They are very pigmented because I already swatched them for myself because I wanted to see what I was getting myself into before I did makeup videos, before I did a review or a swatch video. So, these are colors. Those are all nine colors. And I could already see myself doing stuff with this, which I'm guessing it's good because if I looked at this and I was like, huh, eh, I would have been like, okay, your makeup stuff is over. But I am feeling this blue a lot. This one, I'll tell y'all what, let's sneak peek. And I will just put it right here. So, that is a sucky ass swatch. But yeah. That is a sneak peek of palette number one, the festival palette from Juvia's Place. And the second palette that I got from Juvia's Place is, let me throw that in the trash. Okay, that wasn't trash. Um, is the Zulu palette. Oops, the Zulu palette. And I think this one, nope, still. But this is my first, my second top choice. And I have been hunting on this and hunting on this and it is finally here the zulu palette so i am not gonna do i'm i mean i'm not going to do swatch videos i'm not gonna do an in-depth review because i am late to the party and there's a whole bunch of videos with this palette so y'all can just take it into consideration and know that i got the palette and i will be doing some looks on the palette so, I don't have to waste my time doing swatches. Okay, so here we are. The infamous Zulu palette, all colorful and stuff. And I think I am going to be using this for my first makeup look. You already know what the colors look like. No, I will not be showing you a swatch of this one. I just had to show a swatch of the Zulu palette because I haven't seen that many videos on it, that many makeup looks, and all of that good stuff. So, yeah, that is why I showed you guys. But, know that I will be using these palettes, okay? I will be using these palettes. And the next one is my top one from the Juvia's Place. The Juvia's Place. No, it's The Magic by Juvia's Place. And this is it here. Look how big it is. And you know what? You see the colors here? I'm doing a makeup look. One eye, each color. What, bitch? Yes, one eye, both colors. I mean, two eyes, these colors. So one eye's gonna be yellow, one eye's gonna be blue. That's how we gonna do, yes. Okay. 
Okay, Juvia's Place giving me ideas and stuff. Look at y'all, girls. <laughs> Back in the game. But, um, yeah. So, everybody know what the magic palette looks like. Everybody know it's the bomb palette. Everybody know it has colors in there. And some people know that it's patchy with the purple and patchy with the blues and blah, blah, blah. So, I'm not going to get into it. I'm just going to show you the packaging. And I am going to show you the colors. And this is the palette I am doing my first makeup look with. So, get into it because this purple will be on my eyes. This, which one is purple? Which one is purple? This purple will be on my eyes. Maybe this green, maybe this red, or is it orange? Nope, red will be on my eyes. They are, they are beautiful, I'm telling y'all. And I think each one is supposed to tell a story. I don't know. From what I heard, they're supposed to tell a story. They're supposed to go with each other. No. But, um, yeah. I'm so excited, guys. So, so excited. So, if you want to see any kind of color look, let me know. If you want me to incorporate anything, let me know. If you want to see a cut crease, a halo, a regular, everyday, smegular damn makeup look. Let me know. I'm trying to get back into makeup. So I need y'all help, okay? Y'all with me? And, um... I also have wigs that I am going to be doing makeup looks on. So, I have a question for you. Do you guys want to see wig reviews on my channel? If not, I'm still gonna do it because I just really want to do it. I want to do something different besides just all makeup. So the last thing that I wanted to show you guys, I think, oh well, okay, I'll show you guys this. This is the um, Instant Age Wine Eraser for Dark Circles. This is in a color golden. Don't know if I got the right shade, so yeah, I don't know. But um, last thing was this package that I received for Physician Formula. So hopefully it matches me and I will be doing a review on it so look for that look at this packaging like they they just try they trying they, they getting it they getting it they stepping their shit up so yeah you will be seeing a review on this foundation on me on this channel soon and with that being said if anybody is an NC45 in MAC Okay, please let me know what shade you use in the Maybelline Superstay because I'm, I don't, I don't want, I don't want to, I don't want to have to buy two different shades just to find my shade. You know, like if y'all NC45 in Mac, let me know what shade of Maybelline Superstay foundation because I would really like to do a review on that. I know I already have two, but you know, but yeah, your girl is back. And I will go into details in another video of where I've been, what's been going on, why I've been gone. But this is what you get a makeup haul. Just to help me get my feet wet. Okay? So, if you like this video, thumbs up. If you didn't like it, thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys want to see. Hashtag blah blah blah. And let's get these videos on the pop it. Anyway, I am your girl Sherry Chapman. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And share your bitches video, okay? Or watch it five times. I don't care. Do whatever you want to do, okay? It's your world. I'm just in it. So, peace, love, and happiness. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.